Hello and welcome to Kindred Spirit Tarot. This is your daily message for all zodiac signs for Wednesday, the 30th of May 2018. Thank you so much for joining me. If it's your first visit, welcome. If you are returning, then welcome back and thank you. Today's reading is from the Good Tarot by Colette Baron Reed. Okay. This is my friend Wooday's favourite deck. I do love this deck myself though. I think the illustrations on the water cards are absolutely outstanding. Okay. What is the message from Spirit for my wonderful friends? For Wednesday, the 30th of May, 2018. What is it my wonderful friends need to know? Thank you. Thank you. From the Good Tarot. For Wednesday, the 30th of May, 2018. Thank you. The King of Fire. Followed by the Ten of Fire. And followed by the Six of Fire. Okay, the King of Fire. This is, some of you are, I really I keep getting the words personal power and I feel that you are coming into your own personal power for sure, for real. <sighs> this King, he is about power. He is about success. He's about growth, he's about harmony, he's about real masculine energy. He is also a king who uses his heart, he's really heartfelt. He feels for people, he feels for his subjects. He feels really responsible for his subjects. He would be a wonderful advisor, he's a real cheery, happy-go-lucky kind of character he is a really happy character of feeling all the kind of the energies of the sun that come from him I, I do feel you know good times I feel joy I feel happiness I feel friendships all coming from this energy I feel that you are today some of you feeling really accomplished you are feeling good about yourself. You are feeling happy with yourself. And you are feeling that your heart is in the right place. And back again. Your next card, the Ten of Fire, the Ten of Wands. This is again the reminder for some of you, maybe you have overburdened yourselves. And I love that comment, <laughs> by the way, about the parasite finally being off your back. Absolutely brilliant. But this is a different way to describe the Ten of Wands. This is asking you to declutter. Declutter your space, declutter your, your physical space and to declutter your, your, your mind. We can declutter our physical space by, you know... If we've taken too many burdens on by giving away some of those burdens or maybe clearing a space, doing some clearance, clearing out drawers, wardrobes, kitchen cupboards, having a bit of a spring clean or maybe meditating, taking some time out, zone out and clear out your mental space, declutter your brain space. And next we have the Six of Fire, the Six of Wands, back again. Again, we are balanced, we are harmonious. This is real, a real union between you and spirit that has taken place. This is real victory, achievement. And I'm also feeling like a karmic debt has been repaid. You're, you're really off karmistic cycles. You are... You, you have you have put negative energy behind you 
and you are really focused on your future you are feeling really passionate about your future i really feel that you're flying high that's what some of you are doing today there is lots of passion heartfelt passion there is lots of action lots of energy lots of ambition some of you are really feeling successful you are feeling achieved you are feeling powerful your heart is in the right place you are you are happy you are i feel your friendships are flourishing your relationships are flourishing this is like you are blossoming and blooming and oh it's beautiful to see you are decluttering your space your physical space, your brain space, you are doing this with passion and you are doing this with ambition. This is you. This is your action and the spirit in which you are acting in the real world, in the physical world today. You are honouring yourself today by understanding that you need this space around you so that you can fill the space with balance, harmony, I really feel that you are flying high. You are on a higher vibration. And also for some of you, this could be a journey. Maybe some of you are, are going on a journey. Maybe this is a spiritual journey that you are now on. Maybe you are walking the spiritual path. Wow. Oh, guys, what a wonderful message. I'm drawn to angels. Healing with the Angels, Doreen Virtue. A real fiery, passionate message today. Wow, okay. What is it my friends need to know? From Spirit. For Wednesday. Oh, thank you. You've been asked to... Put more music into your life. Listen to music, play music, maybe maybe after you've decluttered and made some space for yourself and some time for yourself, maybe you could take up learning a musical instrument. But putting music on, maybe for some of you, maybe there may be a song that comes on the radio and the words may have a resonance for you today. Maybe just putting music on and while you're doing your your everyday chores you can be swaying to the music and that too can put you in a high vibration oh look at how all of the tones of these colors are all absolutely flowing as well today the flow of music music is calming it is peaceful it really does put your vibration in a good place get some music in your life today guys okay we'll go secret language of color this is by inner cigar what is the message for my wonderful friends for wednesday the 30th of may 2018 what is it my wonderful friends need to know from the secret language of color for wednesday 30th of may Oh, thank you. That flew straight down to the floor, so I'll just retrieve that. And you get mauve. Enjoy clear hearing. I think we've had mauve before, haven't we? Let's have a look. Mauve. A pale lavender lilac colour. Connects to intuition. Awakening your inspiration, expanding your spiritual awareness, helping you let go of heavy, dense energies. Mauve also creates a sense of peace and tranquility to assist with eye and ear problems and improve your memory and the ability to concentrate. It is a colour of softness, gentleness and allowance. So today you are using your inspiration. You are expanding your spiritual awareness. You are letting go of heavy and dense energies. And you are using mauve and music to assist you with your peace, your tranquility 
and to help you with your eye and ear problems. Wow. Okay, we'll finish with a trusty steed, of course. Oracle of the Unicorns, Cordelia Francesca Brabs. Yet another wonderful message for you from Spirit. What is the message for my wonderful friends from Spirit for Wednesday the 30th of May 2018? What is it my... Woo! <laughs> Flow. Find an easier path forwards, surrender the outcome and release your expectations. So listening to music will definitely help you in the flow, will definitely help you release expectations and surrender the outcome because you will only be thinking about the music at the time. And so your your path, the flow on your path will be able to move forward because you will have taken the resistance out of it. Finding an easier path forward. Again, Declutter, get rid of any dense energies. Absolutely wonderful message again for you today, guys. You are definitely in the flow. Remember to declutter, make some space, get rid of negative energy, get rid of dense energy so that you can fly high, you can remain in the flow, your heart can be open and stay in the right place so you can attract all of those good energies to you. And, guys, stay in the flow that is the message today well thank you for all of your likes your shares welcome you subscribers thank you so much for your support you have joined a wonderful family of kindred spirits and thank you too for your wonderful kind supportive comments do keep them coming i enjoy receiving them and i wish you all a joyful a peaceful and a truly blessed day and until tomorrow, my friends, goodbye.